Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how to extract a piece of lace from a solid background. Um, this particular image I got from Google, but when you try to make yours, please use a piece of lace or an image that you own. Um, you can do this by purchasing your own lace at a store like Walmart and then snipping it to size and um, securing it against a black or at least solid color background and taking a picture or scanning it. Um, so the first thing um, the first thing that most people would do is use their magic eraser and erase the black by one click. Um, that would leave a lot of jagged lines and a lot of pieces where the black just simply wouldn't go because it's slightly um, perhaps gray or a different color. Um, for our purposes, this is black with, I guess it looks like a green tinge on my screen. The first thing that you have to do is right click and then click layer from background. This will allow us to edit this layer. Then you need to click on the channels tab and you need to uncheck RGB and then you need to cycle through the three different um, color channels and see which one has the biggest difference between black and white and for this one it's blue. Make sure that blue is the only channel that's visible. Right click and duplicate that channel. Click OK. Then you need to turn on the blue copy and turn off the original blue layer. And then we need to go to image adjustments levels and we're going to bring the left slider toward the middle a bit to make the gray I'm sorry the black a little bit darker this won't change the actual image it's just changing this particular channel copy so I'm going to bring it to about 34 and then the right slider will make the white stand out more and I'm going to bring this a little, a little bit. Um, about here looks good. Then click OK. Now that we have that done, we're going to get our magic wand, our magic wand tool, and we're going to click in the black. Everything that's black here is going to be selected, but we want the white selected. So go up to Select, Inverse then we know that we can get it a little bit better so we're going to click refine edge and you can only do this I think in CS5 and up but I'm not entirely sure about that you definitely can't do it in the older versions of Photoshop my settings are already here edge detection is 0.5 smooth is 1 and feather is 0.5 what we need to do now is Make sure that the brush size for your refine edge is at, I have it at 111. Then we need to brush all along the lace. And as we're brushing, we will be able to see what we're doing because the lace will be more revealed like this. Just color it over until every bit of lace has been revealed again. This just selects every teeny piece that's white within this within the lace. Now that we have that done we can see how smooth and good it looks. Click OK. Then you need to turn on all of your channels. Turn off the blue copy. Select RGB. Then go back to your layers panel. Down on the bottom you see this icon for adding a layer mask. I need you to click that. And as you can see, every bit of lace is revealed, but none of the black. If you want to see just how good it looks, I'm going to put a, a red behind it, just so that you can see. And as you can see, every bit of white in the lace has been revealed. If you want it to stand it a little bit better, you can always duplicate the layer and there you go. 
it doesn't even have to be white lace. White against black is always better, but this actual lace was more of an ivory beige color. And there you have it. If you have any questions, um, please comment and please like and subscribe and check out my other videos. Thank you.